Hi, my name is Bud Kraus. I'm your friendly web design instructor, and I'm going to show you how to use text edit to create a simple web page. Text edit is a text editor that's on every Macintosh computer. You have to make a few changes before you can get started. So let's do that by starting with launching the application. And as you can see, there are some toolbars here. We don't want those. So what we do is we go to text edit preferences. And there are two changes you're going to have to make. One is on the New Documents tab, switch over to plain text. Because we don't want the rich text formatting system, we want plain text, which is what web pages are after all. And Open Documents tab, I want to just click off here so that we ignore rich text commands in HTML. So that's fine. Now I have to close the Preferences tab. And I also have to close the application. So I do that over here. Now before I can get started, one real important thing I've got to do is to quit the text edit application. So I'm going to do that right here. Now when I relaunch text edit, look at that. Perfect. No toolbars and I'm all set to go. Well, I've already got some starter code ready to paste into my text edit application. And so I'm ready to go. Now I'll show you what this is real quick. Right here is what's called a doc type statement that tells what kind of HTML, or in this case, XHTML, I'm going to be using. This is an HTML opening tag. All HTML files, also known as web pages, are divided into two sections. One's the head section, one's the body section. My head section already has a title tag in there. This is the title of a document, and this particular title is something that I use in my online class, Intro to HTML and CSS. Of course, you would put your own title in that would describe the document's contents. So, to get started, what I'm going to do is just save my file, or save as, since I haven't saved it really yet. So we're going to give it a, a file name, and I'm going to call it index.html because all home pages are, the file names are index.html, and I'm going to pretend this is going to be a home page. And I'm going to save this. Perfect. Uh, yes, I do want to use the HTML extension. And my file pops up over here on my desktop. And now I'm just going to put it in my browser. Oh, there's nothing there. Well, that's not really true. What we do have is the title of the document right here in the title bar. But we don't have anything in the body section of the file because we haven't put anything there yet. Well, let's go ahead and do that right now. And I'm just going to do that by adding some content. Some, something very simple. I'm going to start a very small paragraph. And I'm going to say, hello world. And I'm going to save this file. Again, I could use um, I could use the um, command S, or I could use the menu just like I did. And now I'm going to refresh my page or refresh my browser. And what do you know? I've got "Hello World" in there. How about that? That's pretty cool. Um, and then I'm going to add a second paragraph and say, "This is a lot of fun." I think I can learn this. And my answer is, oh, yes, you can. Uh, because I've taught a lot of people how to do it, so it's not impossible. And uh, it's certainly, as you can see, relatively uh, manageable. So I'm going to save this over here. And uh, now I'm going to reload the page again. And here's my second paragraph. So. We're all set, and what you've just learned is how to take text edit, change it so that you can use it to create web pages, and how to get started with a web page.